Welcome to the Intel Android Context Sensing SDK. This SDK has been deployed by multiple phone manufacturers. This is now live on every Zenfone 2, for example, over 20 million of them, and also downloaded by end users, millions of end users. This is Automated, which is an app that uses all of our functions in the Context SDK. The functions include getting information off of all of your sensors on device, from a tablet, from a phone, from a laptop. And so you can see some of the sensor information right here. You can see the location, you can see the activity, you can see the network status of, of this phone here. You can also see all of the gestures and other inputs that I've given to this device. Then there are a number of other sensor types that I can get that show all the variety of information that I can get about this single device. Now since we've encapsulated all the sensor fields that we can get off phones, we decided to extend this SDK into new dimensions and new classes of devices. So one of the classes of devices that we're adding are drones. So we have a unique Typhoon Class H here with multiple cameras, tons of sensors understanding what it's doing and where it's going, and we can flow this information into the same context-aware cloud. So here we can understand the, flats, the flight status, flight time, individual rotor status on each one, the power status, and all of this data is really useful for understanding the state of the device and if this is part of your personal cloud of devices, understanding all your devices as kind of a holistic um, image of all the sensors around you. But what can you do with that sensor information? Well, for this drone, I can actually have this drone recognize its controller. So this drone can pull in data from the camera and recognize my face and understand that this is the correct controller for this person. And then if I put up a gesture with my hand, uh, this drone can recognize that gesture and can use that as a control mechanism. So it can say, okay, when Ned puts his hand like that, that means stop in midair, stop flying. Or when somebody else gives a control, and it's not Ned, I'm not gonna recognize that face as a control. So being able to actually influence the behavior of a device through the sensors is what we're doing here with the Context Sensing SDK.